hi everyone welcome back to our channel so today in this tutorial i'm going to show you how do you use panda by app so let's get into the video so firstly what you're going to do just uh, download the panda by app from your play store or your apple store so just get that downloaded and then once you've downloaded here so you'll see something like this here so before i go further so as you may know so panda bay is just actually it's it's an app where you can shop from china okay you can like make any purchase from uh, from china so all the products are from china so you can make the purchase online from china and then what happens is that it will be shipped to the local uh, local panda bay warehouse in um, in china so it will be shipped to the panda bay warehouse and then once it get to the warehouse then you can like actually do a q a of the product that you just bought and then once you are satisfied with the product and you can like further ship it to your home globally so wherever you, you are located in which whatever country you are so that's how it works so it's pretty easy it's it's pretty a uh, uh, effective way of, sh of of shopping from china although it's a bit time consuming but it's an effective way so let's get into it so once you have opened up your uh, panda bay app here so firstly you need to create an account all right so firstly if you click on the uh, there's two tabs here home and account if you click on the account tab here so basically what you can do you can click on this go to sign up option so basically just enter your country your username email address and create a password and then hit on sign up or you can also sign up with your google account if you want that so so you just need all these information and you will be you'll be able to create an account so let me log into my account as well okay so i've logged into my account here so once you click on the account tab once you have created your account you'll see something like this your account with your account details and everything so again as i said so the process is pretty simple so firstly we need to purchase something all right and then we get it shipped to the panda by warehouse and then we do a qa and then once it's all good and then we ship it to our homes to wherever uh, it is like where to globally to anyway all right so that's the whole process it is so now so firstly so what are you going to do how, let's uh, let's try it out so let's do a purchase all right so firstly go to this home tab here okay so probably uh, probably uh, 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 if you go to your home tab here so here on your there is a search bar there so on that search bar you can search for any product you can search by by products or if you click on the shop you can search through shop name so you can just search for anything that you want to look that you want to uh, um, that you want to uh, that, that you are looking to buy so you can search that so that's what you use that for and then apart from that there is two uh, two uh, uh, things that i want to uh, talk about so one is the guide so this is a guide here so if you click on the guide there will be a basic guide on our uh, beginner's guide so you can like read through these to, to if you want to know more about panda buy and their uh, terms and conditions so you can read that and then nextly another uh, good uh, option feature here is the estimation so if you click on estimation here you can calculate the 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 amount the time and the freight that you that uh, that's required for your purchase for example if you choose the destination and the warehouse and then uh, and then the weight of the product that you will be that you want to purchase and if you select the category for example let me say the weight is 10 kilo and then if uh, you can you can uh, put, uh, put in more pre more uh, specific uh, dimensions if you want or else just choose the categories so for example clothing common goods if i click on inquire here okay so this will give me the options this will give me the options of uh, of shipping from the from uh, from to the panda i mean uh, to ship to ship from the seller to panda bay so you'll see all these here different uh, different uh, carriers and with their transit times how long it will take and also their their charges here so you you kind of uh, get an idea of this this is not exact accurate but you will get you, you sort of get an idea of roughly what to expect on your uh, what to expect on your when you do the purchase so it's pretty good estimation so something that's pretty uh, helpful so that's an estimation here so apart from that so what you can do if you go to your uh, accounts tab here here you can see all your uh, all your like if you need online support and messages you can see all these options here the help center everything they and then uh, here just one thing that you want to uh, uh, that I want to mention so here is the cart so if you click on your cart you will see whatever that you have added whatever items that you have added to your cart you'll see that and then here if you click on the order option here you will see all the items that you have ordered so far so that will pop up here under order okay and then warehouse if you click on the warehouse then here you will see all the items that you have purchased that are currently sitting in the panda bay warehouse for you to do the qa so you will find it all here so these are pretty uh, pretty uh, uh, pretty handy and also this rehearsal rehearsal means like all the items that are that are all good that once you do once you have uh, done the qa and then here 
what happened panabi will suggest you or recommend you the best uh, carriers to send it to your place to your country or to your place so you'll have the recommendations here which you can browse through and then select from it and then get it shipped to you so parcel this is where you can track all your parcels and all the details of your parcels once once it's been uh, shipping to uh, ship to you so those are the options here so now let's uh, let's uh, uh, buy a product so let me choose a product so i will choose a uh, um something or uh, what can i choose i will just search for search for a uh, search for something to buy a okay, key so let me do that so i'll search so just type in you can just type in and then search whatever product that you want that you are looking for so you can do that okay so for example here so let's me choose this item here so this uh this uh computer speakers here so i'm going to buy that so i'll click on it all right and then uh and this is uh, this is just giving a warning so you can just uh that's just uh, an inspection warning because uh, it's a professional product so we won't be able to inspect it like fully so that's fine you can just leave it that's fine so that's so if you want to buy this so what i'm going to do so what i'm going to do now here is i'm going to click on add it to cart all right and then it's domestic shipping and then choose the quantity and put it to uh put it to add it uh, add to cart all right just the standard choose the color add it to cart all right so now i've added uh, i'm adding this to my cart so what i have to do i can just now process with my uh with the uh, with my uh, purchase so click on your cart and then here what you can do you can select the item and then click on submit okay you can click on submit and also um once this loads so if i just go back just one sec all right so i can select the item and i can also uh, check the estimated international shipping so the time that it will take to it to arrive to your place to your country so if, if you click on estimated shipping then you can find out uh you can find out the uh, uh find out the information i mean the, the time that it takes to uh, to reach your destination for example if you select the item if you select the category say accessories all right okay all right so okay so if you enter the weight so if you click that and if you hit on enter wait and then if you hit on inquiry so select the product if you hit on inquiry so here it will show you roughly see the the different type of carriers and their, and their cost to get it to your place so you can check that so, so to give, just to give you a, a heads up and then once you're done so you just hit on submit and then now you're going to complete the purchase so what are you going to do now here so once you get it so you're going to tick the agreement and then hit on submit and now you're going to proceed with the uh, payment uh, information here so now you can like choose the payment how do you want to make the payment for example if credit card you can choose credit card and then hit on pay and then complete the transaction so once you have bought the item so what happens is you just need to wait for like probably a week for it to arrive to your uh, panda bear warehouse so once it arrives so as i said earlier you can uh, check it under your uh, warehouse uh, tab here so you will be able to look uh, look look for the item so you'll get notification anyhow from uh, from the from panda base so you will be under your warehouse tab here so here you can check the product you can see the images and you can do a quick qc and then once you're satisfied with it you can go ahead and then uh, select the item and then go ahead with shipping submit it for shipping and then you can choose a carrier for you to ship it and then you can get it shipped to your country or to your place wherever you are so that's how it's uh, it is so that's pretty much how you can use it so so panda buy it's pretty it's pretty handy and nice to use although it's a bit time consuming it takes a little bit of time but it's worth it so give it a go and see how it goes so that's pretty much it is so that's how you can use this app so hope this video is helpful to you all i'll see you all in another video thank you